The views are breathtaking, but what really takes your breath away is the heat. Death Valley is the hottest, most desolate place in the U.S. Tourists have always come here in the cooler months. Now, for the first time, there's a summer season. 100,000 visitors a month, almost all from Europe. It's exciting. It's, yeah, it's a better. landscape I have never seen in Europe before. Travel agents began promoting Death Valley a couple of years ago. Now Furnace Creek Ranch, the valley's only oasis, is booked solid in the summer. They've been riding the air-conditioned bus across the desert, you know, and then all of a sudden they get out and it's 130 degrees, pow, right in the face. When you go out, first thing, it's just like, like a, a hair dryer. You, you get it not only in your face, but all over your body. What they expect in a place called Death Valley, surrounded by the Funeral Mountains, overlooking the Devil's Golf Course. As summer wanes, it gets a little cooler out here. Today's a pretty nice day. It's about 112 degrees. That's in the shade. And that's if you can find any shade. Three years ago, a tourist died trekking across these salt flats. He ran out of water. There's water here, all right bad water from the lowest spot in America. It's not fit to drink, but it's cooler than the shore. Why would anyone come to this inferno at the hottest time of the year? It's hot, yeah, but uh, that doesn't matter uh, for the scenic beauty. It took a smart travel agent to convince them they'd enjoy a holiday in hell. Charles Murphy, ABC News, Death Valley, California.